Today, as you stroll along South Congress in Austin, you'll see Penn Field, a well-known modern office park. However, if you take a step back in time, you'll discover that Penn Field played a significant and often overlooked role in the city's history. The story begins during World War I, with the United States quickly realizing just how vital aerial warfare was going to be in winning the war. The Air Service at the time instituted its first phase of pre-flight training for pilots, establishing 32 training camps across the nation. In 1917, Penn Field was one of those camps, serving as an aircraft landing field. Several times a week, dozens of aerial instructors would fly into Penn Field, bringing their biplanes with them. It was here that eager young men would take their first step toward earning their wings. Although Penn Field was built for pilot training during World War I, the war ended before construction of the airfields could be completed. In March of 1918, the University of Texas received authorization to establish a pioneering radio school at Penn Field. To facilitate access, a dedicated railway track was laid, and by November of the same year, Penn Field had a total of five brick buildings, which still stand here today. The original brick structures and aged interiors offer subtle hints of a rich history. Penn Field has become more than just a place. It's a bridge to a past not so easily forgotten.